artist, Doug Pex is here. I'm going through a creative block and I'm doing a year-long endeavor to get over creative blocks in general. Today, I want to talk about the word riot. Right after George Floyd's killing, Minneapolis was a bubbling point. It was one of those things that took me out of everything I knew. The day that Minneapolis burned, I wrote this little poem. Well, maybe it's not a poem. It was before the city burned. It was before the riots had started. And I wrote this. And I want to share this with you because this is what art is about. 27 May 2020. Riot. Riot for your country. Riot for your liberty. Riot for your love. Riot for your will to be. Riot for everyone's freedom. Riot for art. Riot to the punk songs of your youth. Riot for the old soldiers. Riot for the youth in their foolish ways. Riot to riot. Riot for peace and riot for peace. Riot already for God knows what. Will you riot already for the burbs? Riot to end all riots and riot against bigots. Riot, riot, and riot. Until it's time for bed, then riot in your dreams and dream of tiki drinks. Tomorrow, riot all over again. Action items. Riot, check mark. Riot, check mark. Riot, check mark. Find a little bit of myself. Be strong, reflect, remember, reminisce. In all seriousness, I'm really sad that people in power have the seeming right to murder another with very little or no consequences. The system is broken. I no longer support the system and will not tolerate it anymore. Side note, reminisced with Melanie for a while instead. I do not condone violence. I do not condone burning and breaking property. Riot is a metaphor, but it's a serious metaphor. Riot, riot, riot. That is all.